Mark, how many more Harpers dead? Did I... Uh, did I get it right? Selunas tears. It is said no false face can stand beneath their light. An old code Harper. But yes, you got it right. Now I need your report. We had eyes on suspected cultists in the city, like you asked. We thought we were tracking them, but... They were tracking you instead, evidently. Doppelgangers. And they're not just working with the cult, our High Harper. They're part of it. Balists, I think. Sworn to Orin the Red, yes. We've already had the pleasure. Go on. Everything seemed fine until your latest orders. Until we started to search for the Rashimar. They struck the same night. I woke to one of them strangling Chelvin, while smiling at me out of her face. She said, it said, Louis, are you here? And I had no choice. I'm sure it felt that way, Geraldus. The others were likely dragged back to Orin, tortured, sacrificed. I do not expect you to die for me. But to risk Antharl, any citizen who might have wandered in, there is always a choice. And the Harper must be able to make the hard ones. Perhaps this isn't the life for you after all, Geraldus. No, Jahira! Hi, Harper! Please! I'm still a Harper. I want to help! You've scarcely signed up, boy. And there is a war coming. Why die a Harper, when you could still live as anything else? I want to fight. For Chelvin. For all of them. So it means something. Death is death. To look for meaning in it is foolishness, boy. Childish storybook nonsense. <laughs> exactly the kind the Harper would spout, I suppose. Fine. I have no right to make the choice for you. Not when this mess is of my making. I sent the Harpers hunting after the cult, without thinking what it would mean to be hunted in turn. Now they are compromised. And if not for you, I wouldn't even know it. I'm sorry, Geraldus. Harper. And I owe you an apology as well. I haven't told you everything I hope to learn here today. First, Geraldus. You're the last Harper in the city I can rely on. Lay low and rest while you can. I have matters to discuss with my friend here. <laughs> Orin knows the hunt. In one stroke, she places the Harpers beyond our reach, separates us from our pack. Until we know who the false facers are, we cannot trust anyone beyond ourselves. And I was so busy telling you not to take her bait, that I scarcely felt the hook in my own mouth. I have not been overly generous with the truth. I came here to learn of the Chosen, true enough. But I set my Harper searching for someone else, too. Tell me, what do you know of a man named Minsk of Rashomon? <gasps> oh my gods! Minsk! The name is as familiar as Jahira's own. A hero of the time of troubles, who saved the city more than once. Larger than the legend, I assure you. <laughs> Twice as loud, too. Minsk is an old friend. Perhaps my oldest. We fought at one another's backs times beyond counting. And the last time I saw him, I left him to die. There always is. But that is still the fundamental fact of it. Before we ever heard of this absolute, we received word of a gathering in the Undercity. What we found was the first dark seed of this plot. 
A circle of cultists, with mind flares in their midst. We might have ended it there. Cut off at the root, but before I could send for help, Mince charged in alone. It was chaos. He was overrun. Dragged down beneath a mass of tentacles. I had a choice. Stay, and let word of this cult die with us, or leave him, and live to fight another day. And would again. The world takes much from those who presume to defend it. But sometimes, you get to take it back. Infection. Indoctrination. Eradication. That has been the fate of everyone the cult has captured so far. But it has not been yours. With your help, perhaps it need not be Minsk's either. Because I was playing the pragmatist, and writing my friend off for dead, then I met you. If I seem suddenly flushed with hope and soft feeling, you have only yourself to blame. Oh, the point is moot without a means to find him. Without the Harpers, we shall have to find another path. I'll have a better idea of what that is once we're through the gates. Seems I need to reacquaint myself with this damned city. Shapeshifters in the Harpers. My dad always admired their mission. Said they gave up their entire lives so we could live safely and ask for nothing in return. We'll rout them, right? For the city and for dad. Oren be damned. Her bloody fingerprints are all over this city. The Harpers have been compromised. A balancing power now unbalanced. Jahira's support has been invaluable. We should return it in kind. I fought proudly alongside Harpers once. But it seems we cannot place our trust in them now. Not while Orin has their ranks infiltrated. We can't rely on the Harpers. Not when Orin has them infested with shapeshifters. We're on our own. Though, I suppose we're used to it by now. Even the venerable Harpers are compromised by the Absolute's poison. A grim turn of events. But one we must take in our stride. <sighs> So much for the cavalry riding to our rescue. This is what we get for putting our faith in a network of spies, I suppose. 